Okay, to start out with, this is the doll that my goddaughter picked out from a resale shop. As you can see, her hair is really just tangly, and um, she's a little Gotts doll. And I checked both labels. She's a she's a Gotts doll. Um, not quite pretty, so we're gonna try and pretty her up a little bit, make her make her look a little bit more presentable. I find it odd that she doesn't have any eyebrows, and her face is so plain. But it is a baby's doll, so. Um, we're going to try and do a couple things for her to make her, uh, make her cute. The first thing we're going to do is spray her hair down with just a little bit of room temperature water. It's not too bad, so we might be able to, to comb through this. So we're going to try doing that first. Okay. I'm going to start out with a with a wide tooth comb. So we'll start at the ends and work our way up. Never never pull from the top down because that just pulls out the hair. So we'll start at the ends and work our way up. Try and get some of those tangles out. It's not looking too bad. Okay. Turn her around. Get these ends. Not too shabby. It's not as bad as I thought it was. Okay, and then once you get the ends and they're doing good, then you want to just gradually move your move your comb up. And this is the same process for American Girl dolls as well. Always start out at the ends. And I always try and hold on to the scalp if I start hitting tangles just so it doesn't pull the hair out of the scalp or I'll hold it in like a ponytail and work my way up. Her hair's coming out pretty good here. Okay. Okay, that looks good. So we're going to grab our next item and that is just going to be a regular toothbrush. go through her hair with a toothbrush instead of a regular hair brush just to get all the strands. Okay. There we go. And we're going to do something simple, just two ponytails. My, my goddaughter's uh, two years old, a little over two, so Ponytails and braids are really good for her dolls here. I've learned that very quickly. Okay. And if their hair is really, 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 really frizzy and it doesn't brush out very easy like this, I don't recommend it, you know, to do it all the time. Or if a doll needs her hair straightened, you could always uh, soak their hair under the faucet and use a hot curling iron you start, you, you divide it up just like you would divide up any hair um, with, a, with a comb. And you find out on the wig or on the hair where, where that is. And the first, just do a small area when you first do it, like underneath in the back. Um, and then you'll take the curling iron to the wet hair, spray it first, really, really good. Try and brush it out with a toothbrush, a very thin area, and then take your curling iron from the scalp, and then you will just take it from the scalp and hold on to the bottom the best you can and run it all the way up the hair. And what that would do is uh, straighten the hair out so it won't be as curly. And then you can always, roll, after the hair dries and you've, you've, uh, You've brushed it out. You can take rollers and set the hair and let it sit overnight or for, you know, a couple couple days. The longer you let it sit, the better the curls are going to hold. And you can uh, curl your doll's hair. So now that her hair is brushed out, this is going to be really simple. I'm just going to put two ponytails in her hair and she will be good to go. This is the finished result on this side. And all I did to get that, and I'll show you here what the ponytail looks like, is I just wrap my finger around 
one little spray and I take my toothbrush and brush it around my finger and that just gives that cute little little uh, curled ponytail look and then what I will do is I will just let it sit overnight and it might not stay perfect especially with a uh, two-year-old but it is cute and it should work just fine and that's pretty much it um, also, one other thing is, instead of going to Sally's Beauty and buying rubber bands, you can get these, new, a, a whole, uh, uh, what do you call it, like a little cardboard thing full of mini tiny little rubber bands that are perfect for any small dolls, especially American Girl dolls. And they break easy, as you know, you know, all little rubber bands do, but they don't pull out the hair, and, um... And you get so many, it doesn't matter that your your daughter or goddaughter, granddaughter can style the hair as many times as she wants. And who cares if she loses them? They're less than a buck. The other thing I found with American Girl dolls is I found these, let me just set her down, these Con Air mini pins at the dollar store as well. Um, I, she was using regular bobby pins and they were just way too big and you can get them in different colors for black, brown, blonde here. And they are, let's pull one out here, they are just so tiny. If you look at my fingernail, you can kind of tell it's about the size of two of my nails. Um, so they're really, really tiny and they're perfect for American Girl dolls and little tiny dolls like this. And if they want to do an updo or... This is mainly for older girls. My goddaughter has uh, two sisters, and and they're they're older, so they like to style the dolls here. And I had to find a more economical way to do this. So these are perfect. Um, another thing is when you're spraying any dolls here, especially American Girl. This one it really doesn't matter her eyes are painted on, but. For American Girl, you always want to cover the eyes because you don't want the eyes to rust or get damaged. And always make sure you wipe off the face and, and body and arms. Um, also, if you take like a little washcloth or, or a hand towel and wrap it around their neck so their body doesn't get wet, that really helps too. So those are my tips for, uh, for dolls for tonight. Anyway, next time I will show you how we straightened... Um, our American Girl dolls here and uh, obviously we don't use the hot curling iron on their hair on a regular basis we only had to do it one time for Addie and um, and her hair actually is quite beautiful and longer than any of the American Girl dolls here and that was uh, that was actually a happy happy result so we will see you here next time thank you